When you see a good family on a reality TV show, you have to know if they are religious or not. So, are Ben and Erin Napier from HGTV's hometown? Simply to state yes would be an oversimplification. To know just how religious you are, all you have to do is know Ben's previous occupation before he joined his wife's home renovation business and became a reality star. Any guesses? Well, you may be surprised to learn that Ben Napier worked as a youth minister at Laurel First United Methodist Church in Laurel, Mississippi until 2014. Wait, 2014? Wasn't that the same time the Ben and Aaron were offered the job to have their own home renovation show? Yes, it was. In fact, like the saying goes, good things will come to those who believe. Aaron received the email for the offer from the creators to be part of the show only a couple of hours after Ben had quit the job as a minister. Aaron Napier has revealed in an August 2018 post all the details about the day. She included Ben's letter of resignation to their church where he wrote, This decision comes with much thought and prayer as I feel that this chapter in my life has come to an end. Ben wrote at the time, Aaron and I are not going anywhere and will continue to be active in the life of First Methodist. After Ben informed them of his decision to join his wife at the Laurel Mercantile Company, he continued, When I started professional youth ministry 10 years ago, I knew that it was not a forever career, he wrote. This has been the most educational and fulfilling chapter of my life, but it is time for me to move on to the next one and take up a full-time role in the business Aaron and I started back then. Once again, we feel that God is calling us to make another step with him. We each have our own special qualities, and God can use them, Aaron wrote in a 2018 Guidepost's essay. If we're open to the opportunities, if we let go of our fears and focus on our hopes, if we look for the blessings that come every day. It was in the same essay that Aaron talked about the email they got just two hours after Ben had submitted the letter proposing the idea of the show. If you share it the right way, you're passionate, and you're authentic about the things that you love and believe in, the other people feel like it gives them permission to believe in it too, said Aaron. At that point, it didn't feel like it was necessarily what God was saying he had planned for us, but instead it felt like an affirmation that he was telling us to keep going and keep following, added Ben. These are not the only times that we have caught either of the couple being religious. They were asked about the role of faith in their life till now and in testing times in a 2018 interview with Lemuria blog. Ben replied saying, Faith has been part of my life for as long as I have been alive, and it's the guiding hand in every decision we make together as a family. When I wonder why in the world this is happening to us of all people in the world, I know that it's God authoring the story, and that gives me comfort in it, Aaron continued to know that we're being used for something he has ordained, for however brief or long term this whole thing may be, makes me feel like we can do this. Otherwise, I would feel too small and too unimportant to have this kind of spotlight. It is nice to have such a religious and nice family grace our TV screens. No wonder Ben and Aaron seem like such wise people and great parents. Their religious side makes them even more lovable to the fans.